If your saxophone neck strap is literally giving you a pain in the neck, you've got to check out this video. Hi, Donna from DonnaSchwartzMusic.com, the site to boost your playing up to the next level. This video is a product review of the Balam Premium Backstrap. Now I'm going to say neck strap because that's what I'm used to, but Jack Finucane calls it the backstrap. Okay, so th I've done a video on the classic Balam strap before, but this is brand new, the premium one, and there's a couple of different features about it that I think you'll really like. Both straps though, um, the purpose is to take the weight of the saxophone away from your neck, and they both do accomplish that. Okay, so while I have this hooked up, let me show you what this looks like on me without an instrument. I'm going to start from the bottom. So uh, we have the hook. It's a very secure hook, okay, with a little nice little piece here that will protect your horn from getting dinged, okay, against this nice... Uh, I guess cast brass, as he, as he calls it, cast brass. All right, and then you have the adjustment part of the strap. And what I do, I just take two fingers and I adjust up, one thumb, adjust down. Okay, so that's how you, you adjust the length on this. Now, you know that annoying problem that we all have, we're constantly adjusting our strap? Okay, well, that's what this little hook and this little piece is for. Uh, what it does is it hooks into the back right over here so that, let's see if I can put it right there, so that you don't have to keep doing that, that constant uh, adjusting and such. Let me get that over there a little bit better. Okay. All right. Turn that back around. Now, in the front, the points of contact are down here, not on the clavicle. Okay. The, the um, aluminum bar is not touching the clavicle. All right. So I just wanted to show you that. The difference between the premium and the classic is that the classic, the aluminum bar goes all the way to the end. In the premium, it does not. This is the premium leather, okay? It's, uh, it's soft, okay? So that's a good point of contact right, right there, and it's not harsh, okay? Now, in the back, um, let me just move my hair. <laughs> okay, so in the back, you could see what it looks like over here. It's a V-shape. Okay, and I'm going to put a little bit of weight on this. It's got a V-shape to it. It's not touching my neck, okay, and um, very secure in the front, and it's not painful at all, okay? That's the shape that it should take. So now, let me show you what the strap looks like without it on me. The very important thing, and this is a, uh, let's do the back view, as you just saw. You want the view, you want it to be uh, in a V-shape. You don't want this to be in a square shape. Think about it. This is going to cut into your neck. Not pleasant. So you want this V shape. So when you get your strap, more than likely, you're going to be able to put it on. It's going to pretty much work. You're not going to have to tweak it or anything. But some people may need to do some tweaking, and that's perfectly fine. Okay, and I'm going to uh, show you two ways to do that. But first, again, the shape, a V shape over here. Super important. You don't want this. In the front, Again, it's going to look like this, okay, from the top view, and then the front view, and then here is the hook, okay? All right, now, the adjustments. Well, when you get your strap, these hooks are going to be in these holes. That's how it's going to come, all right? Most people are going to have uh, the hooks in here because uh, that's their size, that's what they need. For, um, as Jack says, for most females, I'm going to say for some females and people with smaller statures, smaller shoulder width, you're going to want to move these hooks from here to here like I did, okay? Um, this is helpful. And when you do that, you may need to move the aluminum, push it out so that it's not going to um, hit your clavicle, okay? Now, you're probably saying, well, how do I move those hooks? It looks like it's pretty hard. Here's what you do. So I'm looking at this from a front view. I'm going to pinch the leather just like that and I'm going to pull the hook out. Now, if I can do that, anybody can do it, okay? So, I'm just saying that, all right? And then you can pinch the leather and put it in whatever hole you need to. I'm going to go back to where I had it previously and again, same thing, right in there, okay? That's the first adjustment. If you need it, you may not. The next adjustment would be um, for, you see how these 
there's little, um, I'll call them entrails, <laughs> but there's little like, like threads over here. Okay, you don't want to make the strap too wide, nor do you want it too narrow, okay? So this is something that just may take a little bit of tweaking. But you also need these to be of equal length, okay? If one side's too long, well, it's gonna pull on the strap. You're gonna feel it. It's gonna feel very, very unpleasant, okay? And the way to do that is, again, looking at it from the front, you see how there's extra string over here. What you would do, you would pull up the string, and then what you would do is you would pull on the string back here, whoops, back here, okay? Either this way or this way, however way you're gonna make the adjustment. So you just have to pull this up to adjust the string, but you've gotta make sure that both sides are equal, okay? And those are the basic adjustments that you would do for the premium Balam uh, back strap. It is a classy looking strap. It does get the weight off of your neck and it's got a very, very secure hook. Now, if you have any other questions, I'm gonna put the link to the Boston Sack Shop below in the show notes. Definitely um, email them with any questions or concerns and Jack has been more than helpful you know, in um, certainly with my questions, helping me out to make sure that I was able to adjust this so that it fit me really well. Okay, so that is my review of the Balam Premium Backstrap. I hope this helped you um, in your, you know, decision for purchasing maybe a, a neck strap to help alleviate the neck pain. And if you want some more great tips, visit my website, DonnaSchwartzMusic.com. And on that note, take care. Have a great day.